Hello everyone, and welcome to today's presentation where we'll be comparing two major Oracle tools, Golden Gate and Data Guard. By the end of this session, you'll have a clear understanding of what these tools are, their key characteristics, how they differ, suitable use cases for each, and important factors to consider when selecting the right solution for your organization. Before we dive in, let's go over what we'll be covering. First, we'll explore Oracle Golden Gate and Oracle Data Guard. Then, we'll also take a look at the architecture of Oracle Golden Gate and Oracle Data Guard. After that, we'll compare the two tools across different aspects. Finally, we'll discuss use cases and various factors to help you decide when to choose one over the other. Oracle Golden Gate is a real-time data replication and integration solution. It captures changes from source databases in real time. It supports heterogeneous replication between different database types. It offers highly configurable replication processes. It operates with minimal impact on source systems. It supports bidirectional replication. In today's fast-paced digital world, data is the lifeblood of every organization. But what happens when you need to move that data from one system to another seamlessly and in real time? Take a look at this architectural diagram showcasing the power of Golden Gate. On the left, we have Server A, the source of our data adventure. This is where the action starts, with the source database buzzing with activity. Now, every time a change occurs in this database, whether it's an insert, update, or delete, the capture process is on the lookout monitoring the trail files like a hawk. These trail files are essentially the transaction logs, recording every data move made. Once the capture process has identified the changes, it passes them along to the data pump, which acts as a high-speed courier, transporting the data changes over the network to the target system on server B. On server B, the trail files containing the precious data cargo are received, and the collector process quickly gets to work, reading and processing these files. But the real magic happens with the replicate process. This component takes the data changes and applies them to the target database, ensuring that it stays perfectly synchronized with the source, like two peas in a pod. And just like a well-orchestrated symphony, the manager processes on both servers conduct the entire replication operation, ensuring that everything runs smoothly and efficiently. Now, you might be wondering, why would I need such a powerful data replication solution? Well, my friend, the use cases are numerous. Imagine you need to migrate your database to a new platform or upgrade to the latest version. With Golden Gate, you can do it seamlessly, without any downtime or disruption to your business operations. Or perhaps you want to maintain a standby database for high availability or disaster recovery purposes. Golden Gate has got you covered keeping that standby system up to date and ready to take over at a moment's notice. Maybe you're dealing with data from multiple sources and need to consolidate it into a central repository for reporting or analytics. Golden Gate can help you integrate that data in real time, ensuring you always have the freshest insights at your fingertips. And let's not forget about query offloading. If you've got read-intensive workloads bogging down your production database, Golden Gate can replicate that data to a separate system, allowing you to run those queries without impacting performance. With its robust architecture and lightning-fast replication capabilities, Oracle Golden Gate is the ultimate data superhero, ensuring data consistency, availability, and reliability across your entire enterprise. So, whether you're migrating databases, maintaining high availability, or integrating data from multiple sources, Golden Gate has got your back, making sure your data is always where it needs to be, when it needs to be there. Oracle Active Data Guard focuses on high availability and disaster recovery. It creates standby databases continuously synchronized with the primary database. It also provides read-only access to the standby database for offloading read-heavy workloads. It enables automatic failover in case of primary database failure and specifically designed for Oracle databases. Imagine you're running a high-stakes operation where any data loss or downtime could be catastrophic. That's where DataGuard comes in, acting as your guardian angel for your precious data. 
Let's take a look at the architecture diagram on this slide. We have two servers, server A and server B, working in tandem to keep your data safe and sound. On server A, we have the source database, the star of the show, where all the action happens. Every change made to this database is dutifully recorded in the online redo log files, like a detailed journal of every transaction. These log files are then duplicated and sent over to server B as standby redo log files, like a trusted messenger carrying vital information. On server B, the log apply service takes these standby redo log files and applies the changes to the target database, keeping it perfectly synchronized with the source database. It's like having a twin database that's always up to date and ready to step in if needed. But that's not all. The data guard monitor processes on both servers are like watchful sentinels, keeping a close eye on the replication process and ensuring everything runs smoothly. And if you ever need to take control, the data guard command line interface gives you a central command center to manage and configure your data guard environment with ease. Now, let's talk about the real world benefits of this powerful solution. Firstly, it's your ultimate disaster recovery plan. If your primary database ever experiences a catastrophic failure, the standby database can seamlessly take over, minimizing downtime and data loss. It's like having a backup plan that's always ready to go. Secondly, it provides an extra layer of data protection against corruption, human errors, or system failures. With a standby database, you have a safety net that can help you recover from even the most unexpected mishaps. Thirdly, the standby database can be used for running reports or performing analytical queries, offloading workloads from your primary database. It's like having a dedicated resource for your data-hungry applications without impacting your production environment. And finally, Oracle Data Guard makes database upgrades and maintenance a breeze. You can apply and test changes on the standby database first, ensuring a smooth transition before rolling them out to your primary database, minimizing downtime and potential issues. With its robust architecture and efficient data replication capabilities, Oracle Data Guard truly is the guardian of your data, ensuring high availability, data protection, and business continuity for your mission-critical database environments. Now, let's compare Oracle Golden Gate and Oracle Active Data Guard across various dimensions to better understand their capabilities and suitability for different scenarios. Starting with purpose, Oracle Data Guard focuses on disaster recovery and data protection, ensuring data availability in critical situations. In contrast, Oracle Golden Gate specializes in data synchronization and replication, supporting real-time data integration across diverse platforms. When it comes to replication type, Oracle Data Guard typically employs active-passive replication, where a standby database serves as a backup to the primary database. On the other hand, Oracle Golden Gate utilizes active-active replication, facilitating bidirectional data flow between multiple systems. In terms of platform supported, Oracle Data Guard is limited to Oracle databases, while Oracle Golden Gate offers heterogeneous replication capabilities, allowing data synchronization across different platforms and database types. Data transformation capabilities differ as well. Oracle Data Guard provides limited data transformation capabilities, primarily focused on maintaining data consistency. In contrast, Oracle Golden Gate offers advanced data transformation features, supporting real-time business intelligence and bidirectional replication scenarios. Use cases for Oracle Data Guard include disaster recovery, migration, creating secondary systems, and scenarios requiring high availability. On the other hand, Oracle Golden Gate is ideal for real-time business intelligence, zero downtime upgrades, bidirectional replication, data migration, and real-time data warehousing. In terms of flexibility, Oracle Data Guard may have limited flexibility due to its active-passive replication model, whereas Oracle Golden Gate offers high flexibility with support for real-time data synchronization and replication across different platforms. Lastly, when considering high availability, Oracle Data Guard ensures high availability through failover to a standby database, while Oracle Golden Gate supports continuous availability with its active-active replication model. By understanding these differences, 
organizations can make informed decisions when selecting the appropriate solution based on their specific requirements and objectives. Let's delve into their specific applications and use cases. First up, Oracle Data Guard. First use case is disaster recovery. When downtime isn't an option, Data Guard seamlessly switches to a standby database, ensuring continuity of operations. Next use case is high availability. Keep your critical systems online with automatic failover mechanisms, minimizing disruptions and maximizing uptime. Next use case is read-only reporting. Offload read-heavy workloads to standby databases, running reports and analytics without impacting primary operations. Next use case is planned maintenance. Execute upgrades and maintenance activities with ease, utilizing standby databases to keep your systems running smoothly. Lastly, zero data loss requirements. Maintain data integrity with continuous synchronization, reducing the risk of data loss to virtually nil. Now, let's turn our attention to Oracle Golden Gate, the maestro of real-time data management. Firstly, real-time data integration. Seamlessly blend data from diverse sources, ensuring your decision makers have the latest insights at their fingertips. Next use case is data consolidation and distribution. Centralize your data for reporting and analytics, breaking down silos and fostering collaboration. Next use case is bidirectional replication. Keep multiple systems in sync, enabling bidirectional data flow and maintaining consistency across the board. Next use case is data migration and upgrades. Transition to new platforms or upgrade versions effortlessly, without disrupting your operations. Lastly, real-time data warehousing. Power your analytics with up-to-the-minute data, supporting timely business insights and informed decision-making. In the ever-evolving landscape of database management, choosing the right solution requires careful consideration of various factors that can significantly impact the efficiency, reliability, and cost-effectiveness of your operations. Let's explore the key considerations to guide your decision-making process. Firstly, it's crucial to evaluate your database environment. Take stock of your current database infrastructure, including the types of databases you're using, their versions, and any specific configurations. Ensure that the chosen solution is compatible with your existing setup to facilitate seamless integration and minimize potential conflicts. Next, consider your high availability requirements. Determine the level of uptime and availability your organization needs to maintain critical operations. Assess whether the solution offers robust failover mechanisms and disaster recovery capabilities to minimize downtime and data loss in the event of system failures or outages. Data integration complexity is another critical factor to consider. Evaluate the complexity of your data integration tasks, including the volume, variety, and velocity of data being processed. Choose a solution that can handle the intricacies of your data integration workflows efficiently, whether it involves real-time replication, batch processing, or complex transformations. It's also essential to assess the performance impact of implementing the solution. Consider how the solution will affect the performance of your existing systems, including latency, throughput, and resource utilization. Look for benchmarks and performance metrics to gauge the potential impact on your database performance and user experience. Cost considerations play a significant role in decision-making. Evaluate the licensing and costs associated with deploying and maintaining the solution. Factor in not just the initial licensing fees but also ongoing support maintenance, and scalability costs to ensure that the solution remains cost-effective over the long term. Scalability and flexibility are essential for accommodating future growth and evolving business needs. Assess whether the solution can scale seamlessly to handle increasing data volumes, user loads, and new use cases without significant disruptions or costly upgrades. Look for flexibility in deployment options, configuration settings, and integration with other systems to adapt to changing requirements. Finally, consider your organizational expertise. Evaluate your team's skills, experience, and capacity to manage and support the chosen solution effectively. Determine whether additional training, resources, or external expertise may be required to ensure successful implementation and ongoing operation. By carefully weighing these factors, 
you can make an informed decision that aligns with your organization's goals, requirements, and budget constraints. Remember to involve key stakeholders, gather input from IT professionals, and leverage vendor resources to ensure a thorough evaluation process and successful implementation of the chosen solution. That brings us to the end of this comprehensive session comparing Oracle Golden Gate versus Oracle Active Data Guard. I hope you now have a solid grasp of the key concepts, differences, strengths, use cases, and selection criteria we discussed. If any questions remain, please feel free to ask in the comments section below. You can also email us for further discussions. Thank you for your time and engagement. Please show your support by liking this video and subscribing to the channel for more insightful content.